everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Nigerians react as you back to Rote Mima Kinde makes a case for his colleague Baba Jesha and he says that show Baba Jesha love and pity the victim. As you had earlier reported, your actors and actresses under Tampan, the Theatre Arts and Motion Pictures Practitioners Association of Nigeria, has expressed disappointment over the alleged sexual abuse of a teenager. But this is your back to Olan Rewaju James, who is popularly known as Baba Jesha. Tampa, in a statement sent to Sunday Scoop, signed by its Director of Research and Documentation, Yemi Abudu, said it will never support any hideous act, but would support the Lagos State Government in ensuring that justice is served. The statement read in part that we find it obligatory to condemn in totality the odious occurrence of pedophilia confessed to by Mr. Olan Rewaju James, aka Baba Jesha, as confirmed by the police. Association Tampa is crestfallen about this act and will reproach and remonstrate the committer of such sexual harassment to prepubescent children. Considering the sensitivity of the case, which is still under investigation, Tampa will never support all acts against what we preach and represent. As an association, we understand the morals and the social norms of our people, and our behavior will always be humiliating. Therefore, we would not fail to support the government in its bid to do justice towards ensuring that such ignoble acts are checked within our society. We sympathize with the parents of the victim and also seize this opportunity to charge all parents to give their children or words freedom to express themselves for the timely arrest of such horrible acts whenever such are committed. And as many people are reacting, including millions of fans of the Uber movie industry, and millions of fans of Nigeria movie industry and Baba Jesha's colleagues. The Yoruba actor turned politician Rutimi Makede also reacted on his official Facebook page. And taken to his Facebook page, he made a case for Baba Jesha. Makinde said that the actor deserves some benefit of the doubt until a court finds him guilty. And in his words, Baba Jesha, the popular comedian, deserves some benefit of doubt until a court of competent jurisdiction prove him guilty of any offense. I understand he was alleged to have committed an illegal act, or is it a crime to be a movie star? Let's be patient, show accuse some love, even as we condemn any bad act. And to stop jumping into conclusions on his alleged assault on the minor, it's like some of us want him down before now. Crime is bad, but crucifixion of any suspect on its own is also a crime. Of course, we can pity the alleged victim. This was what he shared on his official Facebook page. However, a lot of Nigerians didn't find this post appealing as they reacted otherwise to it and blasted this Yoruba actor turned politician. However, it has been reported by Legit NG that Ruti Mimakinde since then deleted this post from his official social media platform. Ruti Mimakinde is not the only actor who has reacted to this news. As we had earlier reported, a lot of Yoruba actors and actresses also reacted on that time. And individually, some people are reacting, like Biodon Okewo took to her official Instagram this morning. In a post Biodon Okewo shared, she shared the photo of Baba Jesha and said, Please, who has the footage where the disgusting, abominable, and unimaginable act is being committed? At least, it's confession. I have some unused causes if he's found guilty. This is hard to believe. Crestfallen is even an understatement. I'm emotionally shattered. Can't wrap it off my head. As a mother, I'm practically in tears. I can't imagine anyone doing such to one's daughter. I will kill the person myself for life. If this is true, then Baba Jesha disgraced us. Let's fight against pedophilia. This was how Bjorn Onkero reacted to this. This is a very sensitive case, and not many people are reacting to it individually. For those who may ask, who is Rotimi Makinde? Rotimi Makinde is a popular Yoruba actor and a businessman, and is also a politician. He is also known to have worked with NMPC for a very long time. He worked with NMPC for 20 years before he later joined politics and was elected into the House of Representatives of Nigeria as a member representing Ife federal constituency between 2011 and 2015 under the platform of All Progressive Congress, APC. It has also been reported a while ago that Rotimi Makinde featured in 193 movies and produced about 13 movies. For those who do not know, Rotimi Makinde made history as the first Nigerian actor to be elected into the Federal House of Representatives in Abuja. Also, it was on the news years ago when the popular Yoruba actor Yemisho Lade came on Lagos State Television LTV8 and said on her that Honorable Rotimi Makinde is not an actor. And at that time, Rotimi reacted to this statement. 
And in his words, I took the statement credited to his supposed friend James Shulady as a complimentary gift for my birthday. I guess he must have been quoted out of context, or perhaps he meant to say, Wilson Makede never lived on acting. I said so because we have been on set and at locations on several occasions in the past. And indeed, he, Mr. Yemishulade, surely knows me to be involved in many other good businesses like hospitality and auto business, where he purchased his very first good car. In line with my principles, I am not prepared to join issues with my friends and colleagues. And not even that man who is far older than I do and who grew up in my community, Leife. Case closed, Honorable Roti Mimakinde. So this is the man Roti Mimakinde. And for those who are asking, who is Baba Jesha? Baba Jesha came into the movie industry by himself, as he revealed in an interview years ago. He could also remember that when he was in primary school, he started by entertaining his friends and classmates. He narrated this from his father, he said. His father used to be a local champion comedian. Anywhere he went to, people laughed over and over. James said that his father was a joke cracker. He started in the early 80s as an actor, playing funny parts, and after relocating to Lagos State, he became a professional job. Though initially, when he was a local champion in his town, James never saw what he was doing as something that would enable him to get three score meets on his table. One thing led to the other, and it became a big deal in the Yoruba movie industry. He actually started his career with AIT, Africa Independent Television. There was a segment there on Mini Jojo. He had a group called Total Child of Africa, where they were about seven in number, and that was how he started with Ambrosio Mide. That was the time comedy started flowing in him professionally, he said. Also, Baba Jesha's mother was a singer, so there was no dull moments in the house when he was growing up. They embraced his vision as well to join the movie industry, because that time, he was just too lousy and talked so much in the house. He has also produced some movies. Apart from an actor, he's also a movie producer. He equally has some comedy packages like Big Mouth, Jesha, Anko, Raga. Baba Jesha had his white wedding ceremony in July 2013. And this actor had his traditional marriage in 2012 with his Samsung big girl wife. The white wedding also was supposed to hold at the Eco FM multipurpose hall located inside the premises of OTV8 in Ikeja, part of Lagos State. There was a time Baba Desha went back to school to study theatre art, and he actually took a break from the movie industry at that time. He had an interview with The Punch, and he said that, I'm back in school studying theatre art at the University of Lagos. I didn't want to be acting and schooling at the same time, because acting requires a lot of attention. However, I didn't take a break from acting. I've been careful about the kind of movies I appear in. These days, I read comments online from fans complaining about the quality of our movies. Being educated is the best investment one can make in life, though education is not necessarily the key to wealth. It is needed to be respected in our society. Education didn't make me successful, my talents did. I went back to school to be able to enlighten myself and step up my game. We have come to the end of this episode, where Nigerians react as Yoruba actor Rotimi Makine makes a case for Baba Jesha, and he says that we should show love to Baba Jesha and also pity the victim.